but I've got this. It's really good. You, um, you can have one. Madam Magistrate said we should be nice to every guest. One with the sounds. There's still some distance to the Huashu Academy. Let's see who reaches there faster. Yang Yang just installed some apps for you, remember? Just look for the one that's called Utilities on the terminal. See? Just open the util... See? See? Just open the utilities, select the grapple, and there you go. If you want to be a hero like the Jinjo Speedster, you've got to master the grapple. Come Wait a sec, someone's looking for me. Yeah? What? When did he disappear? Don't worry, it's all right, I'll be right there. Duty calls, oops, almost forgot. Can't be late. Sorry, Rover, Yang Yang. I've gotta head off for my shift. I'll join you right after I'm done, all right? If you need me, just shout my name, and I, the Jinjo Speedster, will be there in a sec. Well, you only need to send me a terminal message as you shout. Then I'll be there in a jiffy. <laughs> anyway, I gotta go. You guys okay on your own? Give me a heads up when there's any updates. Sure, go do your thing. Don't worry, I'm staying with him. Rover, let's go inside. to my message. She's probably busy in her lab. 
over there must be Mr. Mortify from the Department of Safety. Baiju once mentioned him before. He might be able to help us get in touch with Baiju, but, um, it seems we've caught him at a bad time. Anyway, let's try asking him, shall we? What? You need something? Mr. Mortify, please pardon our intrusion. We are friends of Baiju, and we're here to look for her. I see. I hope I didn't cause any offense earlier. Not at all. It was us who bothered you. Baiju should be in the data analysis room. I'll go tell her you're here. Thank you, sir. This is Mortify, a renowned figure in the Department of Safety. He was born in the New Federation, and he joined the Washu Academy a few years ago. I heard his talent is truly impressive. People say he's a bit scary at first glance, but he's actually quite kind. Here you are. The data we collected in the Gorges of Spirits has been submitted for analysis, and we'll have the results today. I have the equipment for your physical examinations ready too. Any discoveries during your trip to the City Hall? What do you think, Baiju? Hmm. I have a hypothesis about the Sugar Pearl, but I need to verify it first. If possible, I recommend conducting non-destructive tests of all these tokens you have. Data is always straightforward. The first three tokens can be tested at my branch's laboratory. This miniature sundial will require radiographic testing, though. To access the necessary equipment, Yes, Mortify is the branch of Tacitite Weaponry's head within the Department of Safety. One moment, please. Give me the items to be tested. Anything else you need me to know, you can let me know now. You may retrieve your items in 20 minutes, and the analysis report will be ready five minutes after that. Take a right, and you'll find me in the testing room. I don't see anything special with these items. Speaking of the sugar pearl, you all remember eating sugar pearls like this when you were kids? Well, I don't think I've ever had anything like this in my childhood. No, I'm from the New Federation. You mean the sugar pearl might be unique to Huang Long? I remember a nurse lady giving me a candy like that. So, sugar pearls like this were distributed at hospitals, perhaps. The sugar pearl might be a type of medicine. Its sweet taste would have made it more palatable to children. Miss Baija, as a Huanglong local working at the academy, I suppose you already had an idea about what it is? I do have my theory as to what it is, but it still needs verification. I wouldn't proclaim any solid answers before confirming the chemical composition of this item with reliable data. Seconded. Let's find out through actual testing then. It will take some time before the results are ready. If you have other matters to take care of, you should go ahead. I'll let you know once we have the results. Shall we wait here at the Academy, Rover? Sure you can. But don't forget your physical examination. I'll see you in a while for that. Have the equipment ready. I'll need to check your health status and see if there are any unusual fluctuations. Now let's begin if you're ready. Now let's begin if you're ready. Can you try to manifest the crownless's frequency without using your terminal? Hmm. Hmm. I am not seeing the crownless's data in your terminal. So it was indeed absorbed into your body. The crownless frequency energy was consumed by your body, leaving no trace behind. But how did you manage to do that? It's as though there's another mechanism within your body capable of absorbing frequency energy. How do you define monster? For resonators like you, such abnormal fluctuations in frequency typically lead to overclocking. 
This is known as overclocking and is categorized into three levels based on severity. The excess resonance energy harms both the resonator and their surroundings. In extreme cases, the excess energy can even manifest as destructive tacit fields. We have established a comprehensive overclock diagnosis process to accurately predict potential risks of overclocking. Your waveform graph shows a remarkable level of stability, surpassing any resonator I've encountered. Your risk of overclocking should be minimal. You don't need to worry about that for the time being. To put it simply, it seems there is another dimension or a creature hiding inside your body. A universe. That's a poetic and intriguing comparison. It seems we need a simulated combat to figure out what happened in your body. Please hold your terminal tight and stay still. That means simulated training ground. Don't worry, Yang Yang and I will assist you. Please fight the simulated tacit discords like you normally would. One with the sound. Huh. First. had previously detected, your bodily functions are in good condition. And you seem entirely unaffected by the Crownless's energy. Now, we will temporarily boost your resonance ability for further testing. in your frequency energy. So it was not your resonance ability. Hmm. I suppose we'll do another round to fully test your potential. Administering first aid. Acceptable damage. Strategic adjustment required. Let me be your blade. Let the winds roar. Oh, synchronization. Hey, hey, speeding up. Uh. Don't worry, speeding up. Swift and resolute. We have gathered all the data we need. The test is ending soon. Rover, you can find the exit straight up ahead. Rover, can you hear me? Hello? The comm line is dead. Something's wrong. Gotta be cautious. Now, where is the exit? I'm back to the same spot again. And this... No. What is happening? Are those... tacit discords? Rover! 
Oh, thank goodness. You're awake, Baiji. What happened just now? The connection was suddenly cut off. Rover, do you still remember what you saw? Can you give us some more details? A giant tacit discord with a scythe. It doesn't sound like the crownless. Might be even higher ranked. This is the first time we've run into anything like this since we put the training ground into use. The Sonorosphere captures everything that once happened in a specific time and place, be it good or bad. We built this simulated training ground after the structure of Sonorospheres. Our goal was to extract pure remnant energy with the simulated sonorosphere. But we cannot guarantee that all abnormal frequencies were eliminated. Your arrival may have revived the abnormal frequencies we accidentally captured. Remnant energy sometimes gives rise to memory manifestations of sentient beings. You may have encountered one such manifestation. I suspect it could have something to do with your unconscious mind. Such anomalies could have been hiding in the simulation, and they resonated with your subconscious. Or perhaps they were lifted from your subconscious in the first place. I'm afraid I can't give you a conclusion yet. Not until we've run a thorough analysis on the data collected. I'll also check the simulated sonorosphere again to see what on earth happened to it. In terms of bodily functions, you seem to be in perfect health. In fact, all the data look quite good. But if you feel anything unusual, please come find me anytime.